yes dear students now under oxides of phosphorus you know valency of phosphorus either 3 or 5 therefore phosphorus trioxide or pentoxide but those things exist as dimer therefore we used to write p4o6 and p4o10 just the structure of these compounds phosphorus trioxide phosphorus pentoxide structure of these two we are going to see of course p4 in what way we have written do you remember phosphorus 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 this is how we have written the structure of course here we made a bond also in white phosphorus discrete p4 molecule but when it makes phosphorus trioxide or pentoxide what is happening one all the phosphorus is making one bond with the neighboring phosphorus three bonds with the neighboring phosphorus this is how we made now what is happening this is p4 this is p4 all right in between each uh, in between uh, phosphorus phosphorus bond an oxygen atom is added just let me rub this an oxygen instead of this bond an oxygen instead of this an oxygen instead of this an oxygen instead of this an oxygen yes this is how phosphorus pentoxide structure is present phosphorus uh, this bond instead of this bond an uh, oxygen that's all so let me repeat once again phosphorus p4 structure i am writing now yes it is p4 with that p4 six oxygen atoms have to be added how in between each phosphorus phosphorus bond i am making an oxygen atom 1 2 3 4 5 5 6 that's all we got the structure for p4o6 both the structures for p4o6 both are same i have written two times that sir and the bond distance between phosphorus and oxygen is found to be 165.6 picometer bond distance between phosphorus and oxygen is found to be 165.6 picometer usually the phosphorus oxygen single bond will have the bond length 184 picometer but it is shortened usually for double bond it may be shortened but it is not exactly double bond it is single bond only it is because of the d pi and the p pi overlap we say the d orbital of phosphorus mainly dxy orbital the orbital which goes like this dxy dy is a dz x in between axis and then p orbital of oxygen may overlap in the sideways manner resulting in the formation of p orbital of oxygen sideways overlap resulting in the formation of d pi b pi bond d pi of p d orbital of p and p orbital of oxygen resulting in d pi p pi overlap and it is because of that the bond length is slightly reduced than the expected po bond length single bond length po single bond length is this much and it is reduced to this much in p2 o3 that is p4o6 phosphorus triax uh, trioxide is having this type of structure and if we go in for p4o10 let us go into phosphorus pentoxide p4o10 just sim simple modifications i am going to make what is it four oxygen atoms are added in extra how it is happening it is maybe coordination bond with another oxygen po 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 that's all phosphorus has got three bonds extra two electrons it has got therefore it may be a sort of coordination bond po 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 bond four po bonds are made it is represented as double bond 
so that is about the structure of phosphorus pentoxide p double bond o p double bond o p double bond o p double bond o all right now the bond angle may not have disturbed a lot it is 160 picometer is given more or less same the bond length may not have altered much but po bond length the terminal bonds po bonds these are all bridged other things terminal those terminal bonds might have bond length which is little bit lower than this it is found to be 143 picometer that difference you should know if it is p3 let me say it is p4 o10 and it is p4 o6 here the bond angle is little bit higher 165.6 we have given actual single bond length it is 184 po single bond 184 it is lower when it become double bond it is much lower all right the bond angle here the bond angle is found to be 102 degrees whereas it is 120 so o p o bond length is 102 degrees p o p bond length is 120 degrees all right so that difference also you should know is little bit here 123 is given 123 123102 so the bond angle is little bit larger for example the way in which it is written may be it is little bit wider 123 degree so these values you should suppose to know it is o p o o p o it is p o p phosphorus oxygen phosphorus bond angle 120 it is little bit wider it is little bit uh, shorter both are uh, uh, greater than 90 degrees only but it is much greater so that is about structure of p4o6 and uh, p4o10 just a few points you have to remember in what way you have to draw for the examination and the data single bond little bit shortened maybe due to d pi p pi overlap lateral overlap d orbital from here p orbital from here here also d orbital from here p orbital from here that point you should know the bond length here and the bo bond angle bond angle what is the bond length p double bond o much reduced 184 165 143 it is more or less say 160 you can mention that's all bond angle when you can draw p4 o6 and p4 o10 like that you can remember bond angle is lower little bit uh, higher 102 1 2 3 like this you can remember 184 165.6 160 143 like this the transition you should understand so that is about oxides of phosphorus we have discussed only the structure all right thank you